Hi, so you're here watching this video, so I'm assuming you ran into the same problems that I did with my TV, which was that when I pushed the volume key, you know, it would get stuck between two numbers. The highs and lows would just not change no matter how many times you push your volume key. Also that the mute button would get stuck and you would have also intermittent Wi-Fi issues. So let me go ahead and show you three things I did to fix this. Now, I'm gonna go into settings. So with this first solution here, this definitely works, but even this particular solution is only going to be temporary. And you would want to try this last as a last resort. I'm showing you this first because it's something that definitely works, which is if you go into support and then go into self-diagnostics and then go into reset smart hub. When you reset the Smart Hub, it'll prompt you for a PIN number. The default PIN number is 0000. This definitely works and it will fix your volume issue, but try this last. These next two things you will still have to do. Otherwise, even after you reset your Smart Hub, the problem will reoccur. So the next thing is actually to go into General, navigate down here to Smart Features, and under smart features, make sure that these two things are turned off. So you see I have this turned on now, right there. And I have this turned on. You, you want these two things turned off. So basically the smart hub is an app that runs when the TV starts. Now the volume key, it doesn't, it'll get stuck. It doesn't matter whether you're watching TV or whether you're using YouTube apps or other TV apps, um, it still doesn't work. So by the way, that's the second thing you wanna do. The third thing you wanna do is to press home and go into your apps, your app management there. So right there, I'm in my app management. I'm gonna select app management. You'll see when I'm in the apps, in the corner here, you have a couple of things. You have the sign out, which is your Samsung account. You have the search, and then you have the settings here. Like right there, you wanna push settings, and it'll show you all the apps that are loaded into memory. You wanna delete as many apps as you can, because what the problem with the defect is that it's loading too much apps into memory and corrupting the memory. So a lot of the apps that are running, such as the volume and also the Wi-Fi, has intermittent problems because of that. So um, what I did was I deleted all the ones that the software update loaded, and I kept like five of them. You, you'll see here I have actually more than five. Um, you want to delete as many as possible. And so, for example, I'll, I'll delete AMC and I'll delete that and it's deleted successfully. You know, so just keep on doing that. And after you load, you unload it enough of these apps and you turn off your TV, your volume should work again. Now, if that doesn't work, then the last resort is to reset your smart hub and that definitely would work. So uh, those are the three things you have to do to solve the volume issue. Uh, number one, turn off the smart hub features. Number two, delete as many preloaded apps as possible in your apps uh, folder here. And then the third one is if those first two doesn't work to reset the smart hub. So there you go, that actually fixed my problems. It hasn't reoccurred for a month and a half now. But, but I was putting up with it for like two months uh, before I just finally got fed up. So um, hopefully that'll help. Uh, please support this channel by subscribing and liking this video. And, uh, you know, thank you so much for watching.